Three UC San Diego students charged with vandalism on school property thought they were going to face a judge today, but that hearing didn't happen. Uh, they say the charges are nothing more than an attempt to intimidate them and fellow union members who have been protesting against the university. They claim the university isn't honoring the terms of a deal they made last year. CBS State Steve Price joins us live now from UC San Diego Scripps Institution of Oceanography with the details. Steve? Yeah, Marcella and Carla, these students were using sidewalk chalk to draw on the side of that new building, and they did it to coincide with a grand opening party that was scheduled there. But the university says it was an, a very expensive act of vandalism. Protesting outside the county courthouse to support two current UCSD students and a recent graduate who now face felony charges. On Thursday, June 29th, Two Scripps colleagues and I were arrested just outside our homes by UCPD and jailed overnight on allegations of felony vandalism and conspiracy. Jessica Ng, a postdoctoral researcher, and her colleagues were protesting May 30th outside UCSD's new marine conservation and technology facility. They say the university hasn't been honoring the terms of their new contract, so with sidewalk chalk, they wrote fair wages now. A month later, they were arrested. Two felony charges for writing with sidewalk chalk on campus. That is not rational behavior. That is an abuse of power. That's intimidation, and it's de designed to silence us and scare us. Are we going to let them silence and scare us? No! The university released a statement saying the chalk caused damage that cost more than $12,000 to repair, adding the vandals used materials that defaced the walls of the new facility and those materials seeped into the concrete. The concrete had been specially treated to withstand the marine environment and had to be professionally repaired. Yo, see, ASD! Chalk is not a the protesters held their rally outside the county courthouse Monday afternoon because the three people charged were scheduled to have their arraignment after lunch. But the district attorney's office says UC police didn't file the necessary paperwork, so that arraignment didn't happen. So I went ahead and emailed UCSD to ask why that paperwork wasn't filed, but Marcella and Carlo, I still have not heard back from the university on that. Steve, uh, why are they charged with felony vandalism instead of maybe a misdemeanor? Yeah, that's a good question because the students say we were just using sidewalk chalk that kids use all the time on the sidewalk. But the university says because of what happened, the damage was more than $400. And so that's what elevated it from a misdemeanor up to a felony. All right, we'll have to see uh, what happens in this case. Thanks so much, Steve.